Okay. Uh, which enzyme is most likely deficient? We've got adenosine deaminase, hexosaminase uh, A, lysosomal acid lipase, phenylalanine, hydroxylase, and peroximal acyl-CoA oxidase. We've got a five-year-old boy brought to the pediatrician by his parents due to worsening neurological symptoms, including difficulty walking and speaking. He has a history of adrenal insufficiency, and his older brother has similar symptoms. Um, blood tests reveal elevated levels of very long-chain fatty acids. Um, trying to remember the name of it. It's one of the leukodystrophies is what it's describing because we've got like he's got his brother who has similar symptoms so potentially autosomal but likely x-linked he's got worsening neurological symptoms i mean i can automatically get rid of adenosine deaminase because that's going to cause like immunodeficiencies then really? phenylalanine hydroxylase would present much long uh much earlier and it's like key symptom is like the mousy odor if i'm remembering it right i think it's that hexa i cannot pronounce it it's the second one I can't it's remember the name of the condition, though. That's um, okay. Is that what you're going to go with? That's what I'm going to go with. Okay. All right. It's actually this. Okay. Yeah. It's always very long chain fatty acids is always going to be this. Um, what is it called? Peroxomes or however you say this, right? Um, Renoleukodystrophy. Wait, what is it? What is it called, actually? What is the what is the organelle called inside? Is it peroxome? Peroxisome. Peroxisome, sorry, you know, uh, my English is my first language, but dang, I can't pronounce a lot of things. All right, <laughs> peroxisome, right? So the peroxisomes contain this enzyme, of course, that kind of breaks down this very long chain fatty acids. If you don't have it, you're going to have a bunch of symptoms, okay? Um, but adrenal leukodystrophy, X-linked disorder, right? Enzyme for breaking down long chain fatty acids. So if, if you can't break it down, you're going to have a bunch of it, right? And then you're going to have all this, it's, it's kind of toxic, right? So neurologic dysfunctions and also adrenal gland dysfunction. But um, like you said, ADA is going to give you skid, right? Severe combined immunodeficiency, right? So you're going to, like you said, all these immuno issues, right? Tazax disease, right? Is hexadiminase A. So, you know, developmental delays, share and macule, things like that. Lysosomal acid, lipase, right? I don't know if this Woolman disease, right? This is very, very rare, right? And then uh, PKU is the the kind of mousy order, uh, odor, right? Yeah. Phenokitinuria.